All right, so we are live. Welcome everybody to Healthier You in 2022. All right, so I'm just gonna check if we are live right now on Facebook. Yes, we are. All right, so all right, so welcome everybody. So the purpose of this, uh, I'm coming to you live right now, just to inspire you because many of us uh, want to be health healthy this year, right? But most of us don't know how to do it properly. Most of us don't know uh, how to enjoy it, right? Because some people, I've heard a lot of people saying that, right? How did you lose weight during the pandemic? Because it's it's really hard. Like sometimes nakawalang gana or wala, no, no motivation, right? And I know some of you or most of you have seen my post uh, recently about uh, my, uh, my healthy living journey over... Uh, before Christmas, and here it is. Uh, let me just make it bigger. There you go. All right. So yeah, most people are asking me, right? How did you do it, right? Um, because because especially right now when you are in lock lockdown, like again, that you have no motivation. You just want to eat. You just wanna sleep in, or after work, you just wanna lay down on the couch, watch movies, and those kind of stuff, and, right? And and so now that's why. The purpose of this uh, live right now, by the way, in my photo, as you can see, big change, uh, a big change in my health. Because most of most of my life, I've been struggling with my health, uh, with my weight, especially uh, uh, e even before when I was a kid. Like until I became a nurse, like I when I was taking my board exam for my for my registered nurse license, like I really gained a lot. And as you can see, from 220, 220 pounds. To 175 pounds in only three months all right by the way disclaimer uh results vary okay it, it's it, it depends on how much how badly do you want it all right but for me i really wanted it and this is my testimony okay and i'm sure that if i was able to do it i know you guys are able to do it too right so that's why as you can see 220 pounds to 170 one, 175 pounds all right and so now um so that's why again I'm coming to uh, to you live right now just to serve you, just to inspire you, just to motivate you. Because yeah, I, I've been hearing a lot of uh, questions about how did you do it, and guess what? I, I've told you already what what I did during that time is the 30 days to healthy living program by Arbon because I was re ready for a change. Like for me, I'm like I'm not getting any younger anymore. I couldn't breathe properly. I couldn't move properly anymore, and that's why I'm like. I need to make a change, especially, you know, I'm still single. I'm, I'm still pretty young and I'm like, I want to, I want to live until I'm like, what, 80, 90 years old and, you know, spend quality time with my future grandkids. Right. And because I, I, as a registered nurse, I have a lot of patients who are, you know, they're at the age of 60 or 50. They're already so weak. I don't want that. All right, and so that's why I did a third day to live in program. All right, but enough about how how I how I did it. Today, I want to focus on inspiring you guys. Most so, some people are asking me, Red, is it worth it to do the third day to live in program by Arbon? Well, guess what? Tonight we have a special guest. I'm gonna uh, interview interview one of my friends who did the third days to healthy living program, and she will share with you guys her experience. Uh, you're going to learn about her. You're going to learn about uh, what she did during the program. And of course, the massive results. Like she's one of those people who who got uh, who got, who got successful results during the 30 days program. All right. So now without further ado, let's all welcome Jaya Soriano. Hey. Hi, Jaya. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good, good, good. All right. So, Jaya, um, so... So, so tell us, uh, tell me about, tell me more about you. What do you do? Uh, how old are you? <laughs> Hi everyone. Um, good evening. I'm Arjaya Soriano. Um, I'm a, I'm a current, I'm, I'm a, I'm a working student. Um, I'm currently learning, um, computer systems technology at Seneca, and it's really going great right now. And nice. my work right now. Um, I work at a, at a recreational center, so basically what I do there is, um, you know, um, guide people, um, watch them and clean the, clean the facilities and stuff like that, but right now it's closed, so yeah. Right, right, right. So you work in a, in a facility for, you, you, you are a lifeguard, right? Yeah, yeah. 
It's something like that, but it's not. <laughs> what? What do you mean? It's like um, I do their job, like I watch them, but then it's not my responsibility to like if they drown and something like that. It's not my responsible, like that. Oh. I just clean and like sanitize the area since COVID. Oh. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. And how old are you again? I'm 19 years old. 19. Yeah. And you go to Seneca, right? Yeah, I go to Seneca. It's my oh. actually it's my second year now. Second year. So how many years na lang? Uh, my program is like three years, so two more years. I mean, oh, I one more. Year. <laughs> yeah. That's good. That's good. Malapit na. All right. So now I know you. Yeah, you you are one of those people who did the three days to healthy living program, right? But yes. here's my first question, though, and I want you to just enlighten people who's watching right now live, and I, I know some people will watch this as well on the replay, right? So now tell tell us what things were you struggling with in your health? And your skin, before you did a 30 days to healthy living program, how did you struggle before with so health and skin? Mo. So actually, uh, before doing the 30 days program, um, I'm actually um, kind of did uh, gym and stuff like that, but I wasn't consistent. So like, whenever I do workouts and stuff like that, I always binge eating. I always do binge eating, like, uh-huh. um. Like when I get hungry, I didn't I didn't um let myself control like I didn't control myself and stuff like that. So I let my uh, I let myself eat a lot and like have no control about it. But then when you introduce introduce me to 30 days to living and stuff like that, mm-hmm. I I at first was like, oh okay. But then when I think about it, I think it's worth a try. And stuff like that. Mm-hmm. So, I didn't hesitate to say yes to you, and nah. it's really worth it. It's really worth yeah. it. It's worth it, yeah. right? It's worth it. Mm-hmm. That's good. So you said you were struggling with uh, so eating. Your eating habits was really yeah, poor. Yeah, eating habits poor. Yeah. <laughs> so you ate a lot of uh, junk food and uh, mm-hmm. fast food and that stuff. I I feel you. I feel you. Yeah. Right. And uh, it's, it's it's a big struggle. It's it's, uh, it's like, like, like we can be honest, right? It's not uh, that easy to transition. Right to a healthier lifestyle, right? Yeah. Uh, and uh, most of us need help, right? That's why. Let me. Oh, which leads me to my second question: What made you say yes to do the 30 days to healthy living program? Then, uh, you know, I wanted to change my lifestyle. Honestly, like to be honest with you, um, so like. Why? 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 What's um, what's the shift? Biglang naiis mo yon. How how did you start thinking about? You know what? I need to change my lifestyle right now. Yeah. So like, I wanted to boost my confidence in myself. I wanted to like change my mindset on things and stuff like that. So why not start on my body first, and then when it continues, when it's like continue, and it continues, then yeah, like it mm-hmm. follows din naman when I started doing this. 30 days challenge. So like mm-hmm. what made me say yes to yeah. to you is that I wanted to change, right? So like um I wanted to change my health health healthy lifestyle. So like why not start to do the challenge and stuff. Right, like especially that. you're young, right? Like yeah. uh, you know I said sabi ko kanina, this is what I'm saying earlier like you're not we, we are not getting any younger. Especially when we hit that 18 Years old above, like that's when our metabolism starts to go down, right? And then there are mga sakit sakit disease, there are mga masakit na yung, yung legs or whatever, right? So yeah, so why not start now? That's really good. That's really good. All right. So now, my next question though is, um, so you said yes to the three days to healthy living program, right? Now, um, how was the experience though? When you were doing the program, ha, ha, during okay. yeah, when you were doing the program, how was your experience? Okay, so like the first few days, I told my mom, my parents actually, both of them. I told I told them about it, but they at first they were like, "Oh, I know you're not gonna last. You're not you're not gonna do that. You're not gonna finish." <laughs> like they're like down talking me and stuff like that. So mm-hmm. what I did is that I couldn't. I like. I learned to control myself on things that I need to stop eating, 
and stuff like that. But then this one time, actually like many times during the 30 days challenge, my mom cooks a lot of food stuff. Like suddenly she became a, she, she became a, sh- a chef. Like the <laughs> things she cooks like really, really, really masarap. So like... <laughs> Ano ba yung mga food na yun na niluto ng mama? He's the most favorite one is giniling. Giniling and um what what it's called? Um nilaga like that. Nilaga. She, wow. Yeah, that's one, what that's like most of my favorite dishes when so, so how did you how did you overcome that? Like you were you were eating healthy and then your pair or mom is cooking something your your favorite. Like how did you overcome that? <laughs> So like what I did is just um like I said I I still ate the things she cooked but in moderation so like mm. what I did um I I got the bowl small bowl put put mm. the rice and stuff like that so so I tricked my mind so like it's like eating a lot but it's not right oh. so I do that I do that some like a lot a lot of times when I just feel like eating and stuff like that I just put rice in the bowl. bowl yeah, and yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's a That's trick. Good. It's a trick. Yeah. Like, not, 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 not in Korean before. Like, I, I saw that in like a research okay. before. Especially, I, I took psychology in college before. And the, yeah. the, there was one topic about that. Now, if you want to, you know, minimize your the amount you're eating, mm-hmm. uh, get a smaller plate, right? Or a, a, a bowl, right? Just put your food there. Right, because it's in our mind that uh, if we can see that the, the the our plate is full, then in our mind it's gonna say like, oh, I'm full already. I ate one yeah. full plate. But the thing is, it's a small one, right? So it's yeah. like that's, that's really good. That's really good. That's really good. Oh, so so for everyone, so to those of you who's watching the live right now or watching the replay, uh, you try that out. Try that out. Okay. Uh, try it out. It works for me. Yes, yes, it worked for me too, for <laughs> sure. All right, all right. And um, during the program, though, um, did you do some uh, workouts? Because m- most people are asking me this question, like, right, during the program, like, I have no time to work out. Like, I'm, I'm a busy mom. I'm a busy student. Uh, I work full time. When I get home, I'm already tired. Like, yeah. Just, did you do some workouts as well during that time? Of course I did. did. Um... Yeah, yeah, tell me, tell me how, how you did it. Though. How, how were you able to um, adapt? The healthier lifestyle and working out to your busy schedule. Okay, so like, uh, I I time manage my workouts, right? So like, every morning when I wake up, maybe like 5 a.m. because that's when it that's because I'm a morning person, so I usually wake up really really early to do something. So when I add workout to my life, um, yeah, I usually do workouts like 5 a.m. and stuff like that. Um, I usu- I usually just uh walk around the uh, outside and just like you know do a little jogging and stuff like that to just uh, wake myself up and mm-hmm. yeah and then the cardio workout I usually do it before lunch so like uh, yeah that's that's do you do it every day not every day I do it like at least three Three times a day? No, not three, three times, times a, day. a week. Three, yeah, three times a week. Three times okay. A week. okay. So, like, uh, and how long do you jog? How how long do you do your cardio workout? So, I just jog outside for like 15 minutes, 15 minutes, oh. and then, and then, wow. yeah, and then oh. for the cardio, 30 minutes. Hmm. Yeah, wow. 30. So, so 15, 30 minutes long. You didn't even reach an hour of workout. <laughs> Not even, not even. Well, get, guys, for those of you who are watching the live right now, the reason why I'm, I'm surprised like this is because <laughs> what I'm about to show you right now, I mean, in a few minutes, is her before and after photo, okay? And that's why, which leads me to my next question, Jaya. So after 30 days, what are the results that what are the results that you saw in your health, on your skin, on your body after you did the 30 days program? Tell us, inspire us. Yeah. So like I said, I wanted to boost my confidence in things and stuff like that. So after the 30 days, it really made myself it really made myself um gain a lot of confidence 
and you know healthy mindset and stuff like that i changed my ha- old habits into new one like you know binge eating i don't do that i don't do that anymore um i don't i don't eat fast foods as much as i was eating before like that mm. not at all <laughs> yeah good- all i do right now is just eat homemade foods not even outside but when i do, yeah it's it's weird because when i do eat outside it's i'm not used to it really like, well, like what do you mean well, like when you eat outside what what happens my my stomach my stomach is hurting and stuff like that like no nah. when you start when you when you start eating junk food again or fast food after the 30 days program your your yeah. stomach is not used to it anymore yeah no Oh, it's like wow. like wow. Yeah, so it's, yeah, yeah. It's like good. it really affected my life like in a good way though, in a good way. Yeah, yeah, like, well, the th- <laughs> yeah, sorry. Well, the thing is um maganda din is um talagang kasi I've done a lot of diets before, right? But mm-hmm. the thing is it's more of deprivation na I'm going I'm going to eat for a while and then and then you know those kind of stuff. But the thing is, what I love about this is basically you're saying that it's like a lifestyle change. Yeah. Right now, you, you're, you're, um, the way you look at food is now way different than before. Is that right? Yeah. yeah I still eat your meat. Yeah. I, still, I still eat like, you know, stuff like meat and... Um, how do you call that? Meat and stuff like... Ali. the usual the, the usual um food like that but okay. but like when i really eat outside food and stuff no mga fast food yeah mga so that's why food made na lang as much as possible yung kinakain mo right? but see, the meat but the meat that i eat though is like a uh, breast breast chicken chicken breast like that wow do you eat oh. that before or no 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 right now you you eat that because You know, na it's for your health, anyways. It's gonna improve your health, right? Yeah. Yeah. I remember before when you were doing the program, you you mentioned to me that you were adjusting in the first few days, sa kinakain, right, and what you're eating. And I told you, what really inspired me is uh, when I did the program. What I learned is that I should eat to improve my health, not to improve my pleasure. Or not for my pleasure only, and that's my all. That's what I told you, and that's I. I, I hope I was able to uh, help you with that kind of uh, mindset, right, about yeah. food. And because of that, ito na yun, guys. Um, this is Jaya's before and after. After she did a 30 days to healthy living program, from day one she was 155 pounds, and after the, doing the 30 days program, she went down to 139 pounds. And she just told you guys what she did, right? And um, and uh, so for those of you who are saying, "Red, I don't have time to work out and stuff." Guess what? Fifth, how many of you have time to do 15 minutes at least, or 30 minutes to to work out for at least three times a week? Everybody has time, right? As long as you want to really change, right? So if that's if you're ready for a change, guess what? It is really worth it. And if if Jaya can do it, we can do it too. Right? Do you agree, Jaya? Yes, of course. <laughs> yeah, and and which 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 leads me to my last question. It's not a last. Uh, it's, not, it's not even a question, but I just want to ask you if you can say um a message for those people who want to improve their health, the over uh, their overall overall health, and become healthier this 2022. So go ahead. What can you tell them? So yeah, um, I just want to say that. Just try. Just challenge yourself. Like, take the risk, you know, because everything is wor- is gonna be worth it at the end. Like, it's really, really, really worth it. You're you're not gonna regret ev- anything. That's yeah. Good. That's. Good. And do you have any message for those? Uh, because I know you were nine. You are 19 years old. You are a student. You are also working full time. Or and like, yeah. And I know a lot of kids these days. They wanna be like you. They wanna improve their health as well, right? So, any message for the young people like you? For the youths out there, <laughs> uh, just wanna encourage you to do the 30 Living Challenge, not mm-hmm. only for for the pleasure, like Kuya Red said, right? But for your own lifestyle, you know, like 22. It's already 2022. Change. Let's change yeah, yeah. for the better. 
That's yeah. good. Yes, 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 yes. So, bal parang long term. So, yeah, again, to yeah. all the young people, um, think long term. Think long term. It's not about your pleasure only. It's not about just losing weight. But hey, how many of you want to, you know, live longer until you in in and, and spend time with your grandkids until we're like 70, 80 years old, right? So, long term, it's 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 a deeper re- have a deeper reason on how to improve your health about why you need to improve your health all right so yeah that's basically my uh that's basically it um jaya uh thank you so much for being willing to share and inspire us about your your story your testimony about the third day to living program it's really good and i'm really really happy for you and i'm sure for those of uh a lot of people are watching this right now and watching the replay i'm sure they will be inspired as well to follow your footsteps right and i know right now it's not going to stop there do you agree it's yeah, it's, it's a lot of change right and yeah. uh, i'm sure uh you still have do you have another goal health goal for you are you are you there already or you still want to you know manage your it's weight a process. it's a process it's still a process right now so like it's about to get there though it's about to get yeah. there yeah yeah i'm so excited you saw before and after mokaina i'm sure you can reach more right yeah. sa, 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 sa weight loss journey mo so i'm really really proud of you jaya like you. and you, you're welcome you are one of my uh, friends who do the th- third days health living program successfully So so again I'm really really happy and I'm 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 happy that you like the products as well and yeah, yeah. Oh, by the way before we end what's your favorite product by the way in the third day to living set Oh not to mention um yeah so like the 30 days right Yeah yeah okay so my favorite products from that from the challenge is the the energy drinks you know the fuzz the How do you say it? Fistics, Fistics. yeah Yes. Yeah. Bakit, really bakit? Huh? Bakit, bakit? Oh, because it really helps my my energy boosted. Like when I drink it, um, instead of like getting tired and stuff like that, it really made my energy boost. And nice. yeah, it really it's really great. Nice. That. Do you use other Arbon products as well? By the way. Ah uh, yeah, I do. I I actually kind ca- recently ordered um the skincare. The age well oh, kit, okay. and then the um, how do you say it? The acne kit too for the uh, pimple. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And how really is it going? Really going great. Really going it, great. That's good. It's really good. Uh, actually, I'm actually using the acne kit right now. So like, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I'm looking forward for a before and after photo as well. Send it to me yeah. so that. The- with other people who's watching it especially i know a lot of people especially the young young ones who are struggling with breakouts right so mm-hmm. send it to me we, sh- we can share it to the people in social media and facebook world instagram world and let's uh, this let's inspire them as well with your skincare story all right sure. But, uh, again jaya thank you so much for uh joining me uh right now in healthier you in 2022 and uh, i'm looking forward for for more a uh, health goals that you will achieve this year. All right? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jaya. Bye. All right. So guys, that is healthier you in 2022 and that was Jaya uh Soriano and again she is one of she's one of uh, my friends who did the 30 days to health living program uh, successfully. And as you can see in in her before and after photos, her testimonies, she she even shared with you guys her struggled before he did she did the program right and i know a lot of us can relate to that as well all right so uh again thank you so much for tuning in tonight to healthier you in 2022 and i i hope to see you in the next uh maybe two weeks from now i'm gonna have another session like this and let's see who's gonna be our next guest all right all right guys have a good night god bless